That is one giant leap towards an MLS playoff spot for the 10th consecutive season. The Red Bulls on the road defeat the Portland Timbers 2-0. You saw the game on MSG on Wednesday night. Shep Messing and I, Steve Cangelosi, had the call. What stood out about the win? Well, just when you expect nothing, you get everything. I, I love the energy. I love the way they came out, attacked the game. I thought Josh Sims, among others, had a terrific game. But really, it was the attitude. It was the swagger to come out and think you could get a victory in a hostile place like Portland, and they did it. A few nights ago, the trip to the Pacific Northwest began with the Red Bulls conceding a goal in the opening two minutes. Roll reversal this time. It took less than three minutes for New York to grab the lead. The unlikely person to deliver that, Kyle Duncan. Well, it starts with Josh Sims. He gets the ball, forces the turnover, gets it back from Schakowsky, and look who's making the run to the far post. Kyle Duncan, his first goal, he cranks it with the right foot. That's a great goal. Turned out to be the game winner. First MLS goal for Kyle Duncan. It would stand up. Missed opportunities for Portland all night before Danny Royer put the game away with a late penalty in the second half. This team needed something to feel good about. Three consecutive defeats coming in this. They do this a long way from home, and now it's within their grasp to clinch a playoff spot perhaps as early as this weekend. They're back to 500 now. Did they restore the good feeling overall? Steve, I think they did, and you pointed out something during the broadcast. How do you deal with adversity? They set a record. 18 different players have scored a goal, Kyle Duncan, tonight. And that's, that's dealing with the adversity of Bradley Wright Phillips being hurt, having a very subpar season. Uh, they rallied. Uh, Chris Ormus, I think, has a good locker room, a good team. They fought for each other. That's the most goal scorers the Red Bulls have had in one MLS season in their 24-year history, and it ties an MLS record, actually, set by D.C. United in 2016. Big opportunity now on Sunday. Red Bulls, Philadelphia Union, that'll have a big-time feel to it on MSG this weekend. Yeah, that's going to be a huge game. And, and for Philadelphia Union, Jim Curtin has put together a very good team. The strength of his team is in the midfield, so the onus is on Red Bull. Get through that midfield, put pressure on goal. Three more points in the standings will earn a playoff berth for New York. Big win on the West Coast. They're coming home. For Shep Messing, I'm Steve Cangelosi.